Saw Gerrera. He has his origins in the Clone Wars TV series and has appeared in both Star Wars Rebels and he bowed out in Rogue One Star Wars Story. But just who really was Saw Gerrera? Hello Star Wars fans and welcome to another Galaxy Highlight where we bring you bite-sized videos about the various characters, species, planets, and other occurrences of the galaxy far, far away. Today we are going to talk to you about the infamous Saw Gerrera, leader of the Partisans. Saw was born on the planet Andron, a jungle-like planet that was within the Inner Rim. He had a sister named Stila and both were part of a rebel liberation in, during the Andron Civil War. Saw Gerrera was a key member in the fight against the Galactic Empire and in the formation of the Alliance, later known as the New Republic. Although he didn't see eye to eye with members of the Rebel Alliance like Mon Mothma and did his own thing, more violent, more questionable things, he got a lot of work done he, he did put a large dent into the operations of the Empire. Throughout his career as leader of the Partisans, he had started collecting information about the various projects that the Empire had undergone, including the many mining projects that had gone that had gone across the galaxy. This led to the big question, why were they gathering so much material? It was then discovered that of course they were building something big. Saw just didn't know what it was, and he hadn't known until he met Galen Erso. Galen Erso, as we know, is the father of Jin who led the science behind the Death Star, the building of the Death Star. So after all these years of researching, he finally knows what it is. And his only and the only person who he was able to get close enough was the scientist. Well, Galen Erso, Lyra Erso, and Jin both fled from the Empire after learning about how they were being used and exploited. So Saw helped them escape Coruscant and go to a far away planet. The two parents of Jin were eventually killed, and as a countermeasure, Saw Guerrera took Jin under his wing, taught her how to fight, uh, how to shoot a gun, and eventually left her as well. I talk about how Jin has her own abandonment issues in another video, which you can check out right here. Now, as I've said before, he led the resistance of the Partisan, which was a continuation and a separate cell that had origins in the Onduranian resistance. So those ties carried well into what the Partisans are today. He was actually one of the first groups that formed the Rebel Alliance. And even though much of what he did influenced the politics later, the New Republic had suggested that Guerrera and his partisans, though part of the Rebel Alliance, engaged in terrorist tactics. Stila once commented on Saw and how he saw himself as a leader, though no one elected him as such. Saw Guerrera is maybe the original Rebel. I've talked about earlier in my other videos how Chom Syndulla was one of the OG Rebels. I think they would get along to some extent because they were there from the very beginning. When the, when the Clone Wars start, they both had their own resistances of which they led. He is the first one in a long line of people that got trained by the Jedi to fight for themselves, to save their planets during the Clone Wars. Outside of who the character is himself, Saw Gerrera was voiced in the Clone Wars by Andrew Kishino. He also was played by Forrest Whitaker in the Rogue One movie, and he returned as a voice character for the Star Wars Rebels TV series, which I think is awesome. I love when the Rebels or Clone Wars bring in original voice actors from actors from the actual films. It makes it more authentic and it brings everything together. Interesting fact: Saw Gerrera was act was conceived by George Lucas and he was going to be part of an unproduced live-action television series called Star Wars Underworld. Now, we may never see the light of day of this series, but it's interesting to know that we would have seen an earlier version, a younger version, of Saw Gerrera in TV format. Prior to being officially unveiled, Saw was given the codename Castro by various staff involved in the film. Very fitting nickname. His name actually comes from the Argentine Marxist revolutionary Che Guevara, which we learn about in The Art of Rogue One, a Star Wars story. There is so much more to Saw Guerrero than meets the eye. He came onto Jeddah 
was trained by the Guardians and learned how to do guerrilla warfare within the Holy City. And I've covered that in another video as well. If you want to learn more about Saw, you can watch uh, my Jin's First Love video, Guardians of the Whales. Um, got a lot of coverage on this guy. He represents a very gray line as from the from the light to the dark. What is good and evil? And also my War Gullet video actually covers a little bit of that as well. If you guys want to check those out, um, I, that's really all I got to say for this particular in this particular video. I really want to go in depth into Saw Gerrera himself, his various missions, uh, and his personality. There's just so much depth in it for somebody who's only got so much screen time in the newer canon, not just the Clone Wars TV series. And there you have it, everyone. This has been your Galaxy Highlight. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you're a Star Wars fan, be sure to subscribe. That's all for now, and may the Force be with you. Thanks for tuning in today. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. If you're a Star Wars fan, you definitely want to make sure you subscribe. Take the time to visit our Patreon account in the description below to help support the channel and all future products we have in store. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram to keep up with my day-to-day -day vices. That's all for today, Star Wars fans. May the Force be with you.